Hi everyone, welcome to today's session. As part of this session, we will see how can we configure a BW system or BW project in HANA Studio. As you are aware, HANA Studio is a front-end tool which we will be using as a BW consultant to log into our uh, uh, BW on HANA system and start working on our BW related objects. I am in my remote desktop and uh, I am opening my HANA Studio and as you are aware you can also log in via your SAP Logon Pad and view the objects but mostly the HANA optimized BW objects such as ADSO, Composite Provider, Info Object, uh, Maintenance and Management such as Creation, Change, Delete uh, options are restricted only to HANA Studio because these are HANA optimized objects, right? So let us see how can we configure our uh, BW system details in your uh, HANA Studio. Main thing is, first thing, the easy and simple step is, first thing is you might have already have the SAP Logon Pad in your system, right? You add your system details in SAP Logon Pad. In my case, I have BW 7.4 on HANA system, which is already configured in my SAP Logon Pad. Now I am opening my HANA Studio and as you can see from here, we have to first get into BW perspective or BW modeling perspective. See, you see the symbol at the right hand side of your uh, HANA Studio. You have to click on that. Sometimes that won't be visible. All you have to do is you have to click on open perspective, this icon, or else from the Windows perspective, you can go and choose uh, open perspective. And here you choose an option other. When you click on option other, all the installed plugin in your HANA Studio will display. In our case, we have to focus on BW on HANA modeling. So we'll be using BW modeling. When I do the BW modeling, you will see some screen like this. Here, we have not yet configured any project or any system so that we can log in and start working on, right? So you see something called BW project. You have to click on that. When you click on BW project, there will be a pop-up window which appears and it will show all the systems which you have already added in your SAP Logon Pad. You see, we have four systems in my Logon Pad added. Same systems has been shown in your pop-up of this screen in the HANA Studio. All you have to do is, you have to choose BW HANA System Entry or you can double click, you can choose and click on Next. When you go to the Next, automatically all the server details such as application server information, instance number, and even system ID, all those things are copied. All you have to do is here click on next. When you click on next, by default, it will show the client details, the default client details. And username, you can enter your username and password. So in the next screen, you have to enter your client details, user ID and password, and click on finish. This will let you to get into the system. You see now, our system has been added in the project explorer panel. and uh, all you have to do is uh, you just have to exp uh, expand the folder and you see there are three main folders. One is favorites folder, one is BW repository folder, another is data source folder you are able to see. And if you want to log up from your BW on HANA system, all you have to do is right click and you have to use close project. When you do the close project, automatically it is like logged out from your session. If you want to log in again, all you have to do is already it has been configured with your ID for a particular client, you just have to double click and it will give you a prompt wherein you have to enter your credentials and click on OK. Automatically, it will take you to or it will take inside the screen. So hopefully as part of this video, you got to know how to configure BW on HANA system in your HANA studio. So if you are looking for online training on SAP BW, BW ABAP, BW on HANA, Native HANA and HANA related SQL, you can always reach out to me on my mail ID that is venugopalmn1988 at the rate gmail.com. Also, you can reach out to me on my mobile number that is plus 91 followed by 973-998-3992. Thank you so much and have a good one, guys. Also, feel free to share me your valuable feedback and suggestion in the comment section below so that I will be creating a video on the same. Thank you so much, guys, and have a good one.